Alright, this is gonna be the last one. I want to really thank the US Triple Premier for our prize. We are proud. We are a lot of pride. And that's why anyone that comes up to that my door, best be careful. Because I have pride to take care of my family, my property, and my own food, everything else. We have deer hunting every year. Um, I had so much deer in the refrigerator, it's unbelievable. It's mostly ground beef and uh, ch uh, ground truck eggs. Um, uh, the pork shoulder, uh, I just can't complain. You know, I mean, so, for the help, um, believe me. You know, I mean, we do this every year. You know, and it was a lot of fun. Um, at one time, at one time, at one time, one time, one time, one time, the uh, deer were over uh, populating. Okay, they were very over. Populated, you know, and um, they were you climb in your backyard, lost in the middle of the creek. So they doubled it up that year that you could, you know, shoot more deer than you want. But thank God that where I live at, there's a deer reserve, and that's in uh, my Miami Whitewater. Park, which my friend lost. <laughs> this is crazy. Here I am driving around that fucking Jaguar. Red Jaguar. Red, oh, man. To the roof all the way down. And freaking Bob. I, I told him we were going to get in trouble to come back to this park. Because it closes the tent. Or whatever. And all the way across the two mile lake, I can see that pig that's sitting there. We pulled in. I was trying to tell you what the lights were for the outside. You know, and I've never been on track wire before. Like with lights. You know, and it was the middle of the night. This guy's so drunk. It's my brother. God bless Bob Curry. God bless Bob Grody. Say it. Say it, Pooper Scooper. Yeah, say it. God bless Bob. Because you know what? When he was died, he was coming to my house. And we waited. And we waited. And we waited. And nothing. And then the next day, the first thing we heard is he took a brand new Kelly. And drove it right into a pole. Killed him down the spot. And it was a great spirit to come into my house. And, uh, we love my culture. We, uh, I got him off dope. And all that shit. Then he got back on it. So he just wasn't happy. His wife finally died. So I took the shield out of her hip. I don't know what the fuck it was or anything. But she was getting like oxy blood coins because he was nasty. So he had to detox. But he was cool for a while. A couple of joints, a couple of days, yeah, he was all right. Then he started dating this bitch. This bitch! Fucking cunt bitch! That's right. She got him into shooting dope again. <clears throat> Smoking cocaine, everything else. And he never came back to the alleyway. Uh, but he always kept his word. And he gave us some very, very, very beautiful objects. Elephants. Uh, see, I collect elephants. Any elephant with the Tusca pie is good luck. You know? Um, it really is. It's very good luck. And he is a lot of porcelain, pure white, that I keep my lawyer family, which is my paperwork and my Bible stuff. And uh, 
Came to the district where we live. Uh, he taught chastity in state places and does some jams and shit, man. It, it, it was funny, man. You know, he turned me on. Plus a brotherhood. Plus a brotherhood. From Vietnam. But I always do that. And we would never talk about it. No, neither one of us talked about it. But it was one of the sickest, murderistic things that ever happened in history was the Vietnam War. And that's why when uh, L.B. Johnson, you know, went out to develop out of the boards and the rock stars and the rock childs, he his last time, the president of China secretly flew in under radar, and uh, Bill Gates was even in on it. Y'all better be careful. Just get rid of it, Sam. You do understand, Sam. Don't let it fall, please. Stay up for your life. <laughs> Thank you all very much. Many of you may pay attention and, and you know, give a good chance to all you want. But, um, for survivors, um, you, 
just drove my feet in. The Cherokee hates the Confederate for Civil War. And half the Cherokee Nation uh, went to, uh, well, they died in Tennessee. And, uh, boy, there must be some Chinese goods coming in today, boy. You better get ready, boy, because, um, but anyway, yeah, to participate in the, uh, Civil War. And the part of my nation, the Cherokee, is to go north from Tennessee. And they end up in Kentucky. And then some of us moved forward to Ohio, which we never spoke of. But we did. Because Kentucky was Kentucky. And, and uh, if you look it up, it's a Commonwealth state. And that's what I wanted to tell the names of it. Individual at a time conference. It's a Commonwealth state. Ohio is a Democratic state. Okay, it's different. Right below Ohio, every state below it joins out all the way to Florida. Is a Commonwealth state. You better know your laws on what the fuck you're doing when you go to another state. Now, ignorance is bliss. It's your fault for not knowing the laws. So you better watch out when you go into a Commonwealth state and you go to go straight to jail if you got any cuff. But now you are anyway. You know, that's why we moved to Ohio. It's a $168 fine. Big deal. You know, but you know what I mean? But hey, my wife, she works for Dollar Chili. Drink. Or nothing. And I think you all know what I'm talking about. I hope so anyway. God bless you. And I want you all to have a very, very perfect day on me. This is to you from me, Mr. K. Sincerely, Isaiah.com.